Hi guys, let's make some balsamic braised chicken thighs today. Oh, these are super good. They're very tasty. They're great for these nice cool days that are coming up and they're easy to make. If you haven't subbed yet and you would, I'd appreciate it. Turn on that notification button so you don't miss out on anything. Thank you. All right, we're going to finally slice a small onion. This is half of a big one. And we're going to chop four tomatoes. I'm not peeling or seeding these. We're going to put a little oil in our pan. And we're going to start cooking that onion that we sliced. We're gonna cook this for five, six minutes until it's softened and starts to brown. All right, now that these onions are starting to brown and they're soft, I'm gonna set them aside. We're gonna add a little more oil, let the pan heat again. While our oil is heating, we're going to prepare four chicken thighs. I have skin on, bone in chicken thighs here. You can use skinless if you prefer. You can also use chicken breast. We're going to season this with salt and pepper. And we're gonna place them in our pan, skin down. Season this side. I am going to let this chicken cook for about four minutes and then I'll flip it. Okay, this has been cooking five minutes. We're gonna flip it. By the way, I am working on medium high heat. Now we're gonna let this cook on this side for another five minutes. All right, I am going to just remove these for a minute and get rid of the extra fat. Don't you wipe down your pan. We want those brown bits, okay? Let's get rid of the excess oil. Okay, I'm gonna return my onions. I'm gonna put a large garlic clove, which I slice very thinly. I'm gonna return my chicken. Um, I have like two sprigs of thyme, which I just took the leaves off. Uh, one uh, rosemary spray, and I just took the leaves off. Put that in there. About a teaspoon of oregano. The tomatoes that we chopped with the juice. And I'm going to add about half a cup of uh, balsamic vinegar. Oh, yummy. I'm gonna sprinkle about five basil leaves that I just cut. We're gonna bring this to a boil. We're gonna reduce the heat, cover the pot, and let this simmer for about 20 minutes. Let's check out our chicken. Oh, that looks nice. This has been cooking for 20 minutes and I'm pretty sure the chicken is cooked through. You have a lot of gravy here. So this is great with pasta or mashed potatoes or quinoa. You can make it into a bowl, delicious. Of course, you can also serve it with rice. <laughs> okay, let's taste this. You know, I cook with the skin, but I don't eat it. I like that flavor that it adds and contributes to the dish. Plus, it keeps the meat moist when it's cooking. Yeah. Chicken is cooked through, very important. Don't eat raw chicken, guys. It'll make you sick. All right, so tomato, a little onion. Mmm, oh, I love this. It is very tangy from the vinegar. Um, it's got some deep flavors in there. Oh my gosh, this is really good. Really, really good. I will see you soon. Thanks for watching.